Okay, first, put your arms out like this. Okay, then step one foot out like this. Step it back. Yeah! Now hop back. Yeah! You're doing it. Good job. Next, step to the side. Then step to the other side. Oh, and here is Elmo's favorite part, where Elmo gets to wiggle his entire body. Like this. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And hop, hop, and pose. Yeah! Oh, now it's time to put it all together to make the happy dance. Are you ready? Let's do it. Hold up. Step one foot out. Step it back like this. Then hop, hop. Yeah, you got it. Again. Step one foot out. Step it back like this. Then hop, hop. Good job. You're doing it. Now step to the side. And step to the other side. Then wiggle. Yeah. Then hop. Hop. And pose. Yeah. Great dancing. Let's do it again. One more time. Come on. Happy, happy dance, dance. Happy, happy dance, dance. When we learn something new, we do the happy dance, dance. Let's see your happy dance. Yeah. Cool. See you next time. Keep learning. Sometimes the monster that's inside you is a monster that is mad. It's a monster who is angry. It's a monster who feels bad. When your monster wants to throw things and your monster wants to shout, there's a way to calm your monster and chill your inner monster out. So we breathe, gonna breathe right through it, belly breathe. This is how you do it, breathe. Monster may appear at any time in any place, and that my monster will make you make a mad monster face. He makes you wanna push, he makes you wanna shove. There's a way to calm that monster, bring out the monster love. Belly breathe, gonna breathe right through it, belly breathe. This is how you do it, belly breathe. Gonna breathe right through it, belly breathe. This is how you do it, belly go out and in and in and out. That's what belly breathing is all about. Now I feel like myself again. Belly breathe, gonna breathe right Everybody through belly just, breathe. Uh, yeah. This is how Come you on. do it. Just breathe. Yeah. Yeah. Breathe. Yeah. Everybody belly just breathe. Belly belly breathe.
today. Wait for it. Wait for it. Emojis. Oh. They tell people how I feel, like happy, sad, disgusted, or surprised. <laughs> well, that's perfect, Smarty, because Elmo wants to learn all about emotions. Well, what do we do to learn something new? We, we look it up. up! Getting a feel for emotions. Here we go. You can feel all kinds of different emotions, like happy, surprised, mad, frustrated when something doesn't go the way you want it to, even sad or disappointed. Everybody has all kinds of different emotions, but one thing's for sure, feelings can change. That makes Elmo feel great. Me too. <laughs> well, sorry to say goodbye, but I can't wait to see you again. <laughs> Hugging face. Uh -huh. <laughs> Bye, Elmo. Uh Bye-bye, Smarty. Thank you. <laughs> Boy, you show sure off a lot of different emotions. <laughs> that gives Elmo an idea. <laughs> Let's play a game together. Yeah. Come on, come on. <laughs> this boy's having a good time doing a dance. Which emotion is he feeling? The boy is happy. Let's try it. Yep, that is one happy boy. This girl is having a birthday party that she didn't know about. What emotion is she feeling? Sad, angry, or surprised? Is it sad? No. She's surprised. It's a surprise party. Surprise! Now she's happy. Lots of emotions like happy, sad, surprised, and frustrated. Hey, <laughs> that makes Elmo wonder even more. Does Mr. Noodle ever feel frustrated? Oh, let's ask him. Hi, Hi Mr. Noodle! Noodle. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Noodle. Noodle! Mr. Noodle, Elmo was wondering, do you ever get frustrated? You <laughs> do? He can't get the door open. Oh, the door is stuck. That looks frustrating, all right. What do you do to help yourself when you're feeling frustrated? He's screaming and crying. Does that help you get over feeling frustrated, Mr. Noodle? No. Try again, Mr. Noodle. What do you do to help yourself when you're feeling frustrated? He's taking a deep breath. It's helping him calm down and feel less frustrated. That's right, Mr. Noodle. Taking a deep breath is a great way to calm down. It opened. He blew it open. He's happy now. Yeah, oh, looks like you were pulling when you should have been pushing, Mr. Noodle. Oh, boy. Bye-bye. Oh, boy, learning new things makes Elmo so happy. That makes him want to dance. Come on, happy, happy dance. It's Monster Meditation! With Cookie Monster and me, Andy. Ha ha! Oh. Hello, Cookie Monster. Oh! Oh, it me friend Andy. 
Hi, Andy. I see you're baking some cookies. Mmm, smells good. Yeah, but they're not ready. Why cookies take so long to bake? Yeah, it can be hard to wait for something you really, really want. Hey, you want to play a fun monster meditation while we wait? Oh, what meditation? So it's an activity that can make waiting more fun. Oh boy! Follow along and do monster meditation with me and Andy. Great. So we're going to play I Sense, a game of I Spy, but with our five senses. Oh, me know those. Sense of smell, hearing, touch, taste, and sight. Exactly. Now, can you spy something with your sense of smell? Me smell with me little nose. Cookies! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! Ah. Wait, Cookie Monster. Ah. The cookies still aren't ready. Let's pass the time by playing this game. But before we do, we're going to focus ourselves by doing some belly breaths. So put your hands on your belly. Now take a slow, deep breath in and slowly breathe out. <sighs> Great job. Now that we've focused, can you spy something with your sense of smell? Me smell with me little nose. Strawberries. <laughs> Strawberries? Oh, yeah, it me strawberry monster shampoo. Me had bubble bath today. So with that smell in your nose, can you spy something with your sense of touch? Hey, me fur. It's soft and fluffy. Now with that softness in your mind, Cookie Monster, can you spy something with your eyes? Me spy with me little eye. You, me friends at home. Hi. Wonderful. Now, while focusing on your friends, can you spy something with your sense of hearing? Me hear. Ah, uh, me. Loud ringing. Ah, uh, Andy, can you answer your phone, please? Me trying to monster meditate. Um, Cookie Monster, that's the timer. Your cookies are ready. Cookies. Oh, boy, me almost forgot. See, by focusing on your senses, you forgot all about waiting for your cookies to bake. And you still have one sense left. Me do? Yes, your sense of taste. <gasps> Cookie! Om nom wolf, nom 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 nom. Meditation fun and delicious. Oh. <laughs> Hi there! Oh, come on, everybody! Get up and dance with us! Let's play freeze dance. Music! Dance, dance, dance to the music. Pop, 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 everybody! Dance, dance, dance to the music. Dance to the music stops. Oh, and then you freeze like this. Did you freeze? <laughs> Remember, don't move at all. Not even your little pinky finger. <laughs> Oh, very good. Oh, now listen carefully. Wait for the music. Um. Dance, dance, dance to the music. Pop, 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 everybody. Dance, dance, dance to the music. Dance to the music stops. Freeze. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, sometimes it's hard to freeze. <laughs> hey, hello, old buddy. Oh. Hey, can we play freeze dance too? Yes, we love that game. Oh, then what are we waiting for? Oh, are you ready? <laughs> Music! Tickle, tickle, tickle! <laughs> oh, Ernie! Oh, 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 hi! Elmo and Tango oh. are having a puppy play date with Ziggy and Dax. <laughs> and we're going to play... Frost <laughs> Dance! <laughs> and you can play with us, too! Oh. Huh? Uh, Elmo, are you not going to introduce me? <laughs> right! We can't play freeze dance without music! So, put your hands and paws together for DJ Groover! Yes, it is 
I, DJ Grover, when I play the music, that means you dance. But when I stop the music, that means you freeze. Let's play freeze dance. <laughs> The music stopped. That means freeze. <laughs> and now it is time to dance. Oh. <laughs> oh. Phew, that was a close one. Oh. <laughs> Good job. Keep it up. Boy, you are all such good dancers! Now it is time for DJ Grover to get in the groove! <laughs> oh. I'm having so much fun playing freeze dance with you! Freeze It's time for monster yoga! Let's warm up with a dance and shake. Ready? Shake! You can relax. Let's do the elephant pose. Bend all the way down and reach for your toes. Bring your hands together to make an elephant trunk. Imagine you're big like an elephant. Swing that trunk side to side. Slowly roll up and stretch your trunk way up high. Make your loudest elephant sound. Stretch your trunk all the way back down. Let's stomp like an elephant. Ready? Stomp, stomp, stomp. Shake out those elephant ears. Now use your trunk to drink up water. Slurp, slurp, slurp. Swing that trunk up and spray the water out. It's an elephant bath. You did the elephant pose. Well done, little monsters. If you've got a problem and you're wondering what to do, listen up, because I have some advice for you. When there's a problem to solve now, what do you say? You say, I wonder what if, let's try. I wonder what if, let's try. Let's try. Let's say you're building a tower and you want to make it higher, but you run out of blocks. Don't you give up, get inspired, get inspired. You've got a problem to solve now, what do you say? You say, I wonder what if, let's try. I wonder what if, let's try, let's try. Elmo wonders, what could we use instead of blocks? What if we think outside of the box? Say what now? Use some other things to build it high. Good idea! Let's try! Let's try! Keep trying new ideas. An oatmeal container, a wooden ball, a plastic water bottle, and a paper towel roll. It worked! You say, I wonder what if, let's try. Monster Meditation with Elmo and me, Andy. Oh, baby David, Elmo has to go to sleep. But Elmo's not sleepy. Elmo just wants to play. What's that, baby David? You, you want to hear another bedtime story? Okay. Once upon a time... There was a monster who couldn't fall asleep. Hello, Elmo. Oh, it's Elmo's friend, Mr. Andy. Hi, Mr. Andy. Oh, say hi, baby David. Isn't it time for bed, Elmo? Yeah, it's Elmo's bedtime, but, but, but Elmo is having trouble falling asleep. Elmo wants to play. 
Yeah, sometimes it's hard to go to sleep when we still want to play and have a lot of energy in our bodies. So, how about we do a fun monster meditation, Elmo, to calm down for bed? A monster meditation? It's an activity to help you get ready for bed. Yeah! Oh, you and baby David can follow along too. So let's begin with some soothing belly breaths. Take a slow, deep breath in. And now slowly breathe out. <sighs> Very good. Let's do that one more time together. So slow, deep breath in. And slowly breathe out. <sighs> Work, baby David. Let's play good night body. So we're going to start at our feet and say good night to each body part. <laughs> Elmo's going to say good night to his body. That's right. And we're going to wiggle each part as we say good night and then relax it. Want to try it together? Yeah. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> Great wiggling, Elmo. We'll do this through the whole body. Here we go. Good night, feet. Very good. Now relax your feet. And let's move to your legs. Good night, legs. Now relax your legs. What body part comes next, Elmo? Good night, bottom. <laughs> good night, tummy. Good night, shoulders. <sighs> good night, arms. Are you starting to feel relaxed? Yeah. Elmo feels really relaxed. Ah, good night, hands. You did it, Elmo. Now, let's end with one more deep breath. Slowly breathe in and slowly breathe out. Ah. Great work. Are you feeling sleepy, Elmo? Elmo? Oh, good night, Elmo. Sweet dreams. And good night, baby David.
Pickle Daddy. Yes, I know, but I'm gonna keep my eye on you, you understand? Okay, Daddy. Now, now, don't go too far. Which way are you gonna go? Oh, well, Elmo knows the path to take. Uh-huh. Winding all around the lake. Yes, but helmet's on for Elmo's sake. Cause Elmo's riding. Plants and leaves and rocks and trees. Ooh, barking dogs and birds and bees. With two headed monster and me, Andy. Hello, two headed monster. What? What? 
Hello? Hello? Over here. Ah! Oh, I am there. I see your block tower fell over. Oh, yeah, it is over. And go boom! All the way out of the bed, boom! And I can see that you're feeling very frustrated that it fell over. Oh, you know what? Me, my trader. And me, too. Yeah, that's understandable. I know what that feels like. When I feel frustrated, I take some belly breaths. Want to try some monster meditation belly breaths together? Oh, my dummy ball? I don't have my dummy ball. <laughs> no, meditation. So it's an activity to help you take a breath before building your tower again. You do, you do, do meditation too. Let's start by focusing ourselves with some belly breaths. So put your hands on your belly. Now take a slow, deep breath in and slowly breathe out. <sighs> Let's do that again. Slow, deep breath in and slowly breathe out. <sighs> nice job. Now, we're going to pretend that we're blowing out the candles of a birthday cake now. Oh, oh, oh yeah, what birthday cake? What cake? What cake? Happy birthday. No, it's an imaginary cake. Oh, oh cake. yummy, yummy. Yum. Oh, yeah, delicious. Now, we're going to slowly smell the cake using our nose. <laughs> oh. Yummy, right? Uh, mm -hmm. And now let's slowly blow out our candle with our mouth. Happy birthday. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Oh, happy birthday! Now imagine that you're building your block tower again. Yeah. Ooh, there's a nice... Oh, oh that's a good Ooh, there's a nice... Yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa! So when we're feeling frustrated, sometimes we just need to take a break and blow out your birthday candle before trying something again. Now let's build that tower. Okay, I'll put this over here. Oh, there, oh, you did what there, oh, oh, uh -huh. uh -huh. ta -da! Ta -da! ta da Wow, what a great tower. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, thank you. Thank you. No, thank you. Come on, everybody. It's time for one of my favorite songs. Can you sing and point along with me? <laughs> One, two, three! Woo! Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. And eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. 
bubbles there are so enchanting. Yeah, Emma saw them. <laughs> I wonder where they came from. Oh, well, 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 Emma made them. You made them? Mm -hmm. How can you make bubbles? But with a wand. Oh, you mean with a wand like this? No, a wand like this. See, this is a bubble wand. <laughs> a special wand to make bubbles? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does, does Abby want to try? Oh, yes, I do. Okay, here. here. <laughs> Let's see. Bubble, bubble on the double. Oh. Hey, uh, it didn't work. What are the magic words I need to use, Elmo? Well, it's not that kind of wand, Abby. Uh, huh? Abby doesn't need magic words to make bubbles. Mm -mm. I don't? No. Well, what do I need? Just this. <sighs> Is that some sort of magic potion? <laughs> No, Abby, it's just soapy water. Just dip the bubble wand into it to make bubbles. Oh, here. Okay. Um, hmm? nothing happened. What did I do wrong? Well, Abby has to blow on the wand. Oh, blow on it? Hmm? Like, like for luck? <laughs> no, 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 for air. Bubbles are filled with air. <gasps> they are? Yeah, so Abby has to blow air through the little hole into the wand to make bubbles. Ready to try? You bet. Go for it. Okay, so I dip and blow. <gasps> ah, I did it! I made bubbles! I can't believe how easy it is! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Does Abby know what's almost as fun as blowing bubbles? What? Popping bubbles! Oh, yeah! Okay, <laughs> get ready for okay, this. Ready? Ready? Yeah. ready? Yeah. Oh, yay! <laughs> Let's blow bubbles. <sighs> huh, that didn't work. I'll try to blow a little harder. <gasps> Oops, that was too hard. Let me try again. <sighs> oh, it worked. It's a bubble. One bubble. <sighs> two bubbles. <sighs> Three bubbles. Bubbles. One, two, three, four bubbles. Try 
The tree pose. Wow, you're terrific at yoga, Elmo. <laughs> well, gotta get back to my yoga. Namaste, Elmo. Namaste. <laughs> Boy, Elmo loves doing yoga. Hey, that gives Elmo an idea. Oh, come on, let's play a game together. Yeah, come on, come on. Look, these kids are practicing yoga. And their yoga poses look like these animals. Which animal is this boy posing like? A flamingo. Yeah, a flamingo. And how about this girl? She looks like she's ready to jump. The frog. Yeah, the froggy. And how about this girl? Which animal is she posing like? The pigeon? No. How about the lion? Yeah. yeah. She's doing the lion pose. Yay, we did it. Boy, yoga's so cool. Oh, and that makes Elmo wonder even more. Does Mr. Noodle know yoga? Oh, let's ask him. <laughs> hey, Mr. Noodle. Oh, it's Mr. Noodle's brother, Mr. Noodle. Hi, Mr. Noodle. Mr. Noodle, Elmo was wondering, do you practice yoga? <laughs> you do? Oh, show us how you do yoga, Mr. Noodle. Yeah, yeah show, show us. us. Mr. Noodle's playing with the yo-yo. That looks like fun, Mr. Noodle, but that's not how you do yoga. Yoga is an exercise with different poses. <laughs> He's pretending to be a model. Very fashionable, Mr. Noodle. But not those kind of poses. Yeah. In yoga, people do special poses and deep breathing. Keep trying, Mr. Noodle. You'll get it. Yeah! That's it! Mr. Noodle's doing yoga! Great pose! Mr. Noodle. <laughs> Namaste. Boy, learning new things makes Elmo so happy that makes him want to dance. Come on. Happy, happy dance, dance. Happy, happy dance, dance. When we learn something new, we do the happy dance, dance. Let's see your happy dance. Yeah, cool. See you next time. Keep learning. Elmo loves you. Hey, Elmo. Are you ready for some yoga? Yeah. <laughs> Let's warm up with a dance and shake. Ready? One, two, three. Shake! Dance to the music and shake it out. When the music stops, freeze like a statue. Ready? Freeze! Grover, uh, you can stop now. Grover. Grover! <laughs> you can relax. Now, let's do the star pose. Spread your feet wide. Take a deep breath in. Breathe out. Now, spread your arms wide. Take another deep breath in. Breathe out. You're doing the star pose. Great job. Now, open your hands and twinkle your fingers so everyone can see our sparkle. Sparkle bright, little stars. <laughs> we all have feelings deep inside, yeah. Emotions we can't hide. Let's sing and dance, yeah, let's dance them out. Give your emotions a big shout. We feel, we feel, we feel a feeling. I feel, I feel happy. Jump up and down with me. Jump, jump, jump! I feel happy, there's a smile on my face. I'm in my happy jumping place. Jump, jump, jump! We feel, we feel, we feel a feeling. I feel, I feel sad. Be sad like me. Boo-hoo! I feel sad when I can't go outside to play. Feels scared when he tries something new Or if it's 
something jumping out at you. Ah, ah! We feel, we feel, we feel a feeling. I feel, I feel annoyed. Stomp your feet on the floor. Stomp, stomp. Stomp, stomp. Stomp your feet on the floor. Stomp, stomp. Stomp, stomp. I feel annoyed when I'm mad and grumpy as can be. Grr! When everything upsets me. Stop, stop, stop. We all have feelings deep inside. Emotions we don't have to hide. We feel better when we let them out. Give your emotions a big shot. I feel like me! And me! And me! And Elmo! <laughs> oh, wonderful singing, everyone! It is Monster Meditation with your old pal Grover! And me, Andy. <laughs> oh, oh, there is so much I want to do today! Hi, Grover. Huh? Oh, it is my soothing voice friend, Andy! Hello, Andy! Looks like you've got a lot of things. Oh, yes! Today I have to go roller skating, brush my teeth, eat breakfast, and get dressed all at once! Now, if you'll excuse me... Grover? Yes, Andy? I think you're doing too many things at once. How about we start with one thing? A monster meditation. Monster meta-wawa? Meditation. It's a mindfulness activity to help you do one thing at a time. Well, maybe just until I catch my breath. Come on, follow along and do monster meditation with us. Let's start with some belly breaths. So put your hands on your belly and take a slow, deep breath in. And slowly breathe out. <sighs> Very good. Now, we're going to say a rhyme to help us focus and do things one at a time. When you have so much to do, breathe in, breathe out. <sighs> Count one, two, then do. Ah, very clever, Andy. When you have so much to do, breathe in, breathe out. <sighs> Count one, two, then do. I will start by getting dressed. <laughs> Great job, Grover. One thing done. What's next? Well, when you have so much to do, breathe in, breathe out. <sighs> Count one, two, then do. Now I shall have breakfast. Mm. Nice job, mm. Grover. Mm. You're really moving through all the things you wanted to do. <sighs> I am! But when you have so much to do, breathe in, breathe out. <sighs> Count one, two, then two! Now I shall brush my teeth! See how much you can accomplish when you slow down and focus on one thing at a time? <laughs> I sure do! When you have so much to do, breathe in, breathe out. Ah, count one, two, then two! <laughs> Thanks for all the help, Andy, but now I got the roll. You're welcome, Grover. Remember, when you feel overwhelmed, take a step back and do things one at a time. Ah, count one, two, then two! Have fun, Grover. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't worry, I am okay. I have the perfect workout for us. Okay. The Elmo Slide! Ooh, the Elmo Slide? Elmo likes the sound of that. Me too. <laughs> hey, come on, do the Elmo Slide with us. Whoa, it's time to do the Elmo Slide. Mm -hmm. Ready? Everybody flap your arms, here we go. Flap, 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 flap your arms. 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 <laughs> now slide to the front, slide to the back, slide to the side, slide to the other side. Jump one time. One. Jump two times. One, two. Jump three times. One, two, three. You're doing so great, Elmo. Mm -hmm. Keep it up. 
<laughs> Turn around. Turn around the other way. Now the other way again, and the other way again, and again, and again, and again! Get down now. Get up now. Tap your toes. Now touch your nose, that's the way it goes. The Elmo Slide, the Elmo Slide. The Marshall Slide, the Marshall Slide. The Big Bird Slide, the Big Bird Slide. The Elmo Slide, the Elmo Slide. <laughs> Hola! Today, I wanted to go outside and play with Elmo at the park. But my mommy and my papi said that I can right now. It made me feel really, really frustrated. Yeah. Do you ever feel frustrated? Or, or, or sad? Or, or nervous? Yeah? Well, my mommy showed me a way to calm me down whenever I have big feelings or little feelings. It's called belly breathing. Hey! I can show you how to belly breathe. Okay, everyone, put your hands on your belly like this. Very good. Now take a deep breath in through your nose like this. And slowly breathe out through your mouth like this. It feels good, right? One more time, amigos. Hands on your belly. Slow, deep breath into your nose. And slowly breathe out through your mouth like this. Good job. Do you feel better? I sure do. <laughs> now remember to use belly breathing every time you feel, you know, frustrated or nervous or sad. Oh. Ooh. Oh, I gotta go. I have a video play date with Elmo. You know, even though we can't get together, that doesn't mean that we cannot have a play date today. I'll see you. Bye-bye. Hello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I'm Jameer, and this is my show where we ask important questions to learn about our neighborhood. Welcome to Tamir on the Streets. Tamir, my show. <laughs> Today we're answering the question <laughs> What are ways we can use breathing to help us feel calm when we're, you know, feeling angry or frustrated or excited? <laughs> Whoa, a volcano. Cool. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, come on. Let's learn more about peaceful breathing before it explodes. <laughs> Whoa! Ah! <sighs> oh. Uh, hey. What's wrong, Ji Young? Hi, Tim here. Ah! <sighs> what's yeah. going on? Uh, you ever feel frustrated? You know, when you have really big feelings like you're an exploding volcano? <gasps> A volcano? Ji Young, we can do volcano breaths to help you calm down. That's when we let our breath explode out with our big feelings. Oh. Yeah. oh, okay. Everyone start with your hands together in front of you. Okay. Yeah, just like that. There you go. Okay, take a deep breath in, raising your hands. Oh, oh, oh. Good. Then let your breath explode out like a volcano. Okay. <laughs> Oh, nice. Well, let's try that again, but this time you lead, Ji Young. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Um, put your hands together in front of you. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Uh, take a deep breath in yes. while raising your hands. Yeah. I'm up on your breath explode like a volcano. I know you're feeling frustrated, Ji Young, but how do you feel after doing some volcano breaths? Well, I feel a lot better. Thanks. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> numbers. Hmm. Let's see how these numbers can help us calm down when we feel angry or frustrated. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, oh, it's right there. So I just had to stop and take a quick breath. <laughs> okay, I'm good. <laughs> Hi, Grover. <laughs> oh, 
Ah. 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 Hello, Tamir. What are you doing, Grover? Oh, I am practicing four, seven, eight breathing. Four, seven, eight breathing? Yes. I use it whenever I am feeling upset or angry, and it helps me calm down. Oh, well, can you show us, Grover? Of course. But we will need somebody to demonstrate. Oh, oh where? Oh, where will we find somebody to demonstrate? Um, I'm right here. I could uh, demonstrate. Sold. You have got the job. Yes. Now let us begin. Okay. Take a deep breath in. For four seconds. One, two, three, four. Now hold it for seven seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And breathe out for eight seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah! <laughs> great job! Let us do that again. Now, this time, you lead the four, seven, eight breathing, Tamir. Oh! Okay, and you'll demonstrate? I am the monster for the job! Okay, great. <clears throat> okay, uh, take a deep breath in for four seconds. One, two, three, four. Now hold it for seven seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, now breathe out for eight seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> oh, thanks, Grover. I feel peaceful and calm after that breathing exercise. Oh, that is wonderful, Tamir. <laughs> thanks. I gotta go. Okay. Bye. Bye-bye. <sighs> Looks like everything is calm here at Tamir on the street. Today, Ji Young learned that one exercise we can use when we have big feelings is volcano breathing. Oh, and Grover taught us that we can use four, seven, eight breathing when we feel angry or upset. <laughs> you know, I'm feeling peaceful and calm after a great show with all my friends. <laughs> See you next time on Tamir on the Street! <laughs> oh, thank you. The flowers are grumpy because they woke up from their naps. So to get past them, you gotta put them to sleep with a special song. The dance of the sugar plum fairy. <laughs> Good thing the sugar plum fairy's a friend of mine. She taught me just how it goes. Oh, will Abby sing a song and put the flowers back to sleep? Oh, sure. But I'm gonna need you two to help me do it. Here, it goes like this. When you hear Abby's song, you've been up for too long. Time to sleep instead. <laughs> In your flower bed. <laughs> Rest your flower head. <laughs> Take a breath, slow and deep. Fold your leaves, soon you'll sleep. Petal softly sway. <laughs> Dreams are on the way. Listen to me say. With Rosita and me, Andy. Rosita, it's almost time for school. Lista, you ready? Oh, um, almost. <sighs> I don't want to go to school, Carmen. Hola, Rosita. And hello to you too, Carmen. Oh, hola, Senor Andy. It's time for school. Are you all ready to go? Um, yes, but... Carmen is nervous about me going to my first day of school. Is that true, Carmen? And are you nervous too, Rosita? Mm-hmm. See? A little. 
It's okay to feel nervous. We all feel nervous sometimes. How about we do some monster meditation together before you go to school? Meditation? Yeah, it's an activity that can help you when you feel nervous about something, like going to school. I see, muy bien. Come on and do monster meditation with me and Señor Andy. Let's start with some belly breaths. Take a slow, deep breath in. And as you do, bring your arms up over your head. Good. Now slowly breathe out and bring your arms back to your sides. Great. Let's do that again. So slowly breathe in, arms up. Now breathe out and arms down. Very good. So today we're going to focus on our breath and we're going to watch our bellies as we breathe in and breathe out. Does Carmen want to do some belly buddy breathing with us? She does. <laughs> Wonderful. Hold Carmen right in front of your belly. Oh, in front of my belly? Like this? Exactly. Just like that. Now slowly breathe in. And then slowly breathe out. Focus on Carmen moving out and in with your tummy. Let's do this three times together. Belly out. And belly in. Belly out. Belly in. Belly out. And belly in. Nice job, Rosita. Now remember, when you feel nervous or anxious, you can always focus on your breath. <laughs> Great teamwork, Rosita and Carmen. How do you feel now? Mm, I'm still a little nervous, but I think I'm ready to go to school now. Gracias, Señor Andy. You're very welcome, Rosita. Oh, and it sounds like the bus is here. What's the matter, Rosita? Oh, I forgot something. What did you forget? This. Adios, Carmen. Mwah. Gracias, Señor Andy. Adios, papi. Have a great first day, Rosita. Now, the first and most important thing to know is never, and I mean never, let go of the leash. A dog may tug or twist or turn, so here is what you have to learn. Hold on to the leash, hold on, hold on, that's what you need to know. Hold on to the leash, hold on, hold on, and never let it go. A dog may pull or jump or strain, or even chase a poho. Just hold on tightly to the leash, hold on through it all. Do you understand what I am saying, Elmo? Uh, hold on to the leash. Why, you're quick. Let's finish! Hold on to the leash, hold on, hold on, that's what you need to know. Hold on to the leash, hold on, hold on, and never let it. Hold on to the leash, hold on to the leash. Ah. <laughs> Trapped between the walls and underneath the ceiling I feel a bit off track And now I'm trying to get back Back in the cool, cool air where the sun is shining Nothing's gonna stop me, it's all in the timing It's finally again my turn It's time to return Cause I won't stay inside no more to go outdoors mm. Well, open up your door and be like me Open up your door and then breathe free Look at all the beauty you feel Love, 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 love Listen to the music of the wind
emotional with me, all right? Let's start with a happy dance, okay? Jump up and down. Squat all the way down. Squeeze your arms in and make yourself small like a seed. All plants begin as little seeds. <laughs> Here comes the rain. <laughs> you don't need an umbrella, Grover. Seeds need water to grow big and strong. Let's get ready to grow. Stand up slowly like a plant sprouting from its seeds. Hello, sunshine. <laughs> you don't need glasses either, Grover. Plants need light from the sun to grow, too. Now stretch your arms up like little leaves reaching for the sun. You did the plant pose. Yeah. <laughs> Great work, little monsters. <laughs> That's monster meditation with Elmo. And me, Andy. Oh, uh, Elmo really wanted to play. Hi, Elmo. Huh? Oh, it's Elmo's friend Andy. Hello, Andy. What's wrong, Elmo? You look disappointed. Well, Elmo was supposed to have a play date with Abby, but she's sick with the sniffles, and she can't come out and play. Aw, I'm sorry to hear Abby's sick. Elmo too. Elmo doesn't know what to do. I know it can be disappointing when things don't work out the way you planned. I know how that feels. Yeah. Hey, how about we do some monster meditation together? Meta what? Meditation. It's an activity to help you when you're feeling really disappointed. So first we'll begin with some belly breaths. So put your hands on your belly. Take a slow, deep breath in. And then slowly breathe out. Good job, Elmo. Now let's do that one more time. So slow, deep breath in. And slowly out. Now, do you want to play one, two, three, freeze? You're very good at freezing, Elmo. Now to do one, two, three, freeze, we're going to take three steps and then freeze. Mm. When you freeze, look around you and call out what you can see. Elmo's ready. Follow along with Elmo and Mr. Andy. Remember, one, two, three, and freeze. Okay, so one, two, three, freeze. Oh. Now look around. What can you see? Barkley. Hey, maybe Barkley can join you. Barkley, 
Do you want to play one, two, three, freeze with Elmo? <laughs> Great. Here we go again. One, two, three, freeze. Birdies! Oh, and they're making such a pretty sound. They do sound wonderful. Bye-bye, birdies! <laughs> I wonder what else you'll see when you take three more big steps. One, two, three, freeze. Ooh, Elmo sees Slimey and Oscar. That's my name. Now get lost. Oh, Oscar. <laughs> Look at all you can see on Sesame Street when we play one, two, three, and freeze. Yeah, Elmo saw Barkley, birdies, and me? That's right. And now Elmo knows what he's going to do today. What's that? Have a play date with his friends Barkley, Slimy, and Oscar. What? Oh, do you know any grouch meditation, Andy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>